All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of the one, the only, Beyond Two Souls. So not a day goes by that I don't see a comment in the videos that I've been posting where someone is asking, where is the next part to Beyond Two Souls? And well, I've got good news. It's it's right here. You're, <laughs> you're watching it right now. I was doing a little bit of research, spoiler-free research, okay, always. We only have two hours left, which is kind of absurd. And honestly, it just means that shit's about to get real. I don't want to put any negative vibes out there. We know that things always get crazy in this game. So uh, let's just get straight into it. Thank you guys for being here. If this is your first time watching a video of mine or a video of this game, please do yourself a favor. Stop, go watch the first episode and continue because it's going to rock your socks. All right. All right. Oh. Dude, how long has it been? Jody. My little princess. Oh. Ooh, let me look at you, girl. Oh my god, what a beautiful young woman you've become. Just as pretty as ever. No sad and lost. Like the first time I saw you. I can't even imagine how much I missed you. And how's Aiden? Oh, yeah. Uh, good to see you too, buddy. Walk with me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> I was worried. They're looking for you. I had to run away. I mean, I had no choice. Screed experiments, Cole. How's Nathan? Oh, he's the big boss now. He's running the DPA. <laughs> oh. He's come a long way since the days of our little lab. This great experiments, cool. And you? What are you working on? I'm running a small group. We're trying to classify types of entities, see if they're different species, that kind of thing. It's not the highest priority, but I get to do what I want. So. <laughs> this feels like a... Uh... So sort of the last of us type of vibe, you know? Have they made any progress on the infraworld? Oh, they've sunk millions into developing a new condenser. The most powerful ever created. Of course, that was only possible once the army got involved. Hmm. What I talked to you about? Did you find out anything? <laughs> when the day you were born, a woman named Nora Gray had a child in the DPA hospital. Her mom. Her child was declared stillborn. And the father? What, did you learn anything about him? Probably no father, I bet. His name was Jonathan Nichols. Okay. He died before birth. Heart failure. That's all I could find. What else did you learn about her? Not much. All I know is that she took part in a DPA research program some 20 years back. What? She also had a gift. Where is Nora now? She was interned in a psychiatric hospital just after she gave birth. According to wow. her, she should still be there now. been in a, in a mental hospital for 24 years. I mean, why? What happened? That's all the file said. I'm so sorry. I've got to go see her. Jody, I know how you feel, but she's in a mental hospital. You might not get the answers you're looking for. I'm not looking for answers. I just need to see her. I mean, don't you understand? She's my mother. If I'd look her in the eye, I could find out who I truly am. Jody. She's in a high security DPA facility, and you're wanted by every law enforcement agency in the country. You won't be able to walk right in. Nothing's gonna stop me from seeing her. 
Dude, holy smokes. This just got crazy. We actually have a freaking mom. Look. You've taken a huge risk helping me. Thank you, Cole. Wow, dude. Hey. You didn't think I was going to let you go alone, did you? Wait, what? Is that so? Dude, holy smokes. Oh, shit. Dude, this is why I like this game, man. It's it's kind of like a sit back and enjoy the show type of game. No guard on gate, empty parking lot. Something doesn't feel right. I'm not back in 30 minutes. Just go. Girl, I didn't come here to wait in no car. <laughs> Cole, Cole, wait. Oh man, poor Cole. I hope nothing bad happens to him, dude. I have a bad feeling about this, especially the fact that Cole's here with us going inside. I mean, hopefully everything turns out good for him at least. Not another death, bro. Seriously. All right, you go first. No securities. All right, there's one security at the desk. He probably doesn't even know who I am. Try the polite approach. Get some every time. Hey, um, I've come to see Nora Gray. Can I see your authorization? Can you help me out? Look, she's my mother. I haven't seen her in... I'm sorry. All visitors must have the correct authorization. Damn it. That wasn't the polite approach. Okay, listen here, you dweeb. Hmm. All right, before I use Aiden, let me let, let, let me see if I can speak to Cole. I mean, I could just take over him, honestly. See if I can speak to him again one more time. Oh, okay. Well, Aiden, do your thing. Here we go. Do your thing, Aiden. Excuse me. Shut your trap. Founder. Nora Gray, seventh floor, room 43. Hey, there's no call button. Maybe it's behind the desk. Okay, perfect. Dude, I thought that was the, the button for the alarm, not the... Not the elevator. Well, thanks, bro. You appreciate the help. <laughs> Dude, that must be insane. So far, so good. All right, excellent. Everything's going according to plan. trying to do I turn off the cameras
Now unlock the door. That's definitely gonna distract them. Come on. All right, excellent. If I was that guard, I'd probably get the hell out of there. I would honestly think that that place is haunted. And in reality, let's be real. It, it technically is. I mean, we're playing with spirits here. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. There must be something. There must be not only something, but somebody here. Hey, okay, there's a there's a button right there. There's a person on the other side. I think we're gonna have to go. Ooh, there's a camera here as well. He's too far away. What the fuck? Okay, so can I do something to grab his attention? Shit. Okay, hold on. Oh. There we go. We gotta wake him up. Perfect. All right, he's gonna come inside, use his little card. Everything's totally fine. I'm gonna take over his soul. And now he'll open up for us, not a problem. All right, so please come in. You are more than welcome here. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna give you my ID card so you can use it. Oh, actually, I'm gonna knock myself out as well. I don't know if that's a smart idea, Jody. I think you should have set him down in one of those chairs, maybe stuck him in a locker or something crazy like that, you know? But, but but what you're doing, this is just crazy. You're looking for trouble here, Jody. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, so the camera. We got we to gotta watch out for cameras here. Hold on. Make sure there's no cameras. Jesus. Crazy people really freaked me out. Can we find room 43 and get the hell out of here? The crazy folk freak me out. Oh, <laughs> uh, Cole, you need to relax, dude. Hold on. I don't know why Cole is getting ahead of himself. I don't like that. Gotta make sure the cameras are all turned around. What do you say, room 43, was it? Alright, make sure there's. Oh, there's a camera right here. Oh, dude, I wonder if that camera got me. Okay, room 43, room 43. Look at this one right here. Just staring right at me, bro. 43, I found it, Jody. Okay, okay, hold on. Let me get rid of this one. Jody, I'm here. Hold on, Cole. We're gonna get caught, damn it. Trust me, it's happened before. This is a game you gotta learn from your mistakes. Look at this one right here. See? There it goes. Literally, right in front of the camera. Oh shit. Well, wait a minute. Wait, that doesn't matter, right? That means they're, st they're still broken, right? Okay, good. All right, we're just gonna keep going. Let's 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 just go to. Oh god, that's freaky. I'm just gonna go to room 43. Screw it. Let's go. Let's go see what's up here. I'm gonna call it before we enter the room. She's not gonna be crazy. That's just a prediction. I wait here. Jody, she may have lost her mind. Or maybe she is after the sugar child. She might not even know you're there. Maybe you shouldn't go in. Nah, let's do it. If she's crazy, it's probably because she thought her child died or whatever false story narrative they gave her once we were born. You know, that's probably why I would think she's crazy. She's crazy. Okay. You look kind of crazy. I take that back. Mom? Mom, it's me. Judy. 
She doesn't know your name is Jody. She didn't give you that name. So... What are you, what are you trying to accomplish here, sweetheart? Dude, we actually have a fucking mom, bro. This is crazy. See what happened. Well done, Nora. The mother and the father, both gifted. Do you realize how important this baby is? Oh. You won't be able to, Nora. Let us take care of everything. It's for the best. You know that. That's my baby! Bring her back! Quickly. Please. Get the baby oh, out of here. Please. 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 She may Let develop some her. special abilities. Let us know as soon as anything unusual happens. Decrease the dose. Make sure she never regains consciousness. Bro. So her father also had this ability, which is probably why Jody's a bit more powerful, right? Because she's got it from both genes. What I did. What are you trying to show me? Destroy this thing, Aiden. Destroy it now. Oh, maybe that's what's keeping her. Oh, shit. Mom, my little girl. My little girl. see you again. I've missed you so much, Jody. I've missed you so much. What happened? What did they do to you? The drugs they gave me trapped me in this hell. There's nothing, nothing I can do. Just wait for it to end. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get you out of here. I'm going to help you. It's too late, Jody. It's too late. Oh my god. I love you more than anything else in the world. Nothing will ever change that. Dude, this game is Depression Simulator, man. Fucking hell, dude. That's it? Are you kidding me? Wait, 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 wait. 
I don't want to kill her. Fuck, I don't want to kill her. Does that kill her? be really bad because I, I think I'm gonna just kill her to to just end her suffering because she's a vegetable she's in a coma it's kind of like my grandmother and she's she's been a vegetable for like two years now and she's really she's just a corpse she doesn't know anything doesn't do anything and it's like the worst feeling ever honestly um Obviously, if I could, I wouldn't stop her heart or anything crazy like that, but that's just weird and kind of psychotic. But in this game, like for the purpose of this game, it just feels like the game wants me to, to like end her suffering. Like I know this girl's suffering. Bro, I swear to God, every freaking episode is just like... Oh, I can't do it. I told you, nothing but death. Oh, I'm sorry, Jody. <laughs> the fuck just happened? just happened Are you kidding me right now? Don't drink that. You, are you crazy? Yeah, let's check this. Uh, well, I think we're back in the hands of the government, to be honest. Which is obviously not, not a good thing. Damn, look at that monitor. Pretty damn good monitor you got there, bucko. Oh, wait, dude. What if this is... What if this is Nathan's office? It is. Isn't that the... It is. This is his office. Don't tell me this dude. Bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Bro. There's no way. There's no way Nathan would do this to us.
they're experimenting with the I fucking knew it they're experimenting with the other spirit worlds the portal opening the portals and all that stuff which is obviously quite dangerous that's him the most powerful condenser ever created impressive isn't it Nathan oh. <laughs> Good to see you. I was afraid something happened to you. You've lost weight. You look exhausted. But at least you're alive. Let's go into my office. Please have a seat. Bro, look at this man's office. <laughs> um. I've been better. That hit on the head did not help. Oh, I'm sorry. I told them not to hurt you. I just didn't want to give you a chance to use Aiden. Where's Cole? He's at home. He's fine. I know he was trying to help you. Don't worry. There won't be any consequences for last night. Uh -huh. What happened to my mother, Nathan? Nora was unstable. They were afraid she was a danger to herself and her baby. My mother would never hurt me. They couldn't take that chance. Look, I was a researcher at the DPA, Jody. I didn't discover until much later what happened. Why all the lies, Nathan? Those people pretending to be my parents the dpa thought you needed a stable emotional environment a home loving parents some semblance of a normal life whatever would help us study you in the right conditions study me wow study me what was i to you nathan a little lab rat i was just a Girl, for fuck's sakes. I was just a little girl. Oh, you were the link. The link between our world and the infra world. You were everything we ever dreamed of. Wow. I can't believe this guy's saying this shit. So now what? You're just gonna hand me back to the CIA? Is that the plan, Nathan? They brought you here because they have something for you to do, and they'd be very grateful if you do it. Help them? You want me to help the people that took away my mother and stole my life? I mean, haven't I done enough? We know another country has discovered the infraworld. They think it's something to be controlled or manipulated. They have no idea what they're dealing with. If entities enter our world, do you know what that would mean, Jody? What has all this got to do with me? Because you know the infraworld better than anyone. It's the CIA's job. And I'm done with that. <clears throat> they want to offer you a deal. You do this for them. And they let you out, you're free. Jody, do you know what would happen if a passage is open? It'll be the apocalypse. You have the power to stop this. I mean, let's be honest. What am I going to say? No. Hundred <laughs> percent of the players are taking these paths. So 72 asked about Dawkins, 82 distracted the guard, electrical panel, 72 ended Nora's suffering. You see, it felt like the right thing to do. Learn your father's name. Didn't explore the cells with Aiden. Yeah, I should have done that. I, I didn't think about it. I was so worried about the cameras. Ah, oh, damn it. And 98% took the medallion. I was thinking about doing that when I was going to come out of my mother's room, but then that happened.
All right, hold on. Let's. Let me use Iden. Make sure there's. No, I'm not gonna break the television. No, Jody. Don't do that. Wonder why we're having a flashback. Interesting. Tired. What is this? I mean, it seems like they're just letting me hang out here with no worry whatsoever. Okay, so that comes around. Appears to be some sort of mathematical problem that I've got no idea of. Okay, so I cannot go in there. So... Nathan, I'm so tired. Can we go now? Oh, jeez. Is that what time it is? <laughs> I'm sorry. I was concentrating on my work. I know you've had a long day. Hey, this morning I bought your book. What do you say we get you tucked in and I read to you? Yes, please. <laughs> I must have left it in the other room. Why don't you go in there and get it? I'll finish up here, and then we can go, okay? Sure, I'm on it. Hmm. <laughs> the motion cap in this game is crazy good. Marching on the lights. So, where did he leave that book? We're gonna go here first. Nothing here. A lot of electro. Ooh. Stop it, Aiden. It's not funny. Oh fuck! Not this again. That's why I'm not. I'm, I'm not too excited about going into the infra world because uh, this game can tend to be a little spooky, you know. And I'm. I'm just not really all that excited for that. I saw a notebook there on the, on the table. So it's gotta be that. Let me make sure Aiden doesn't see anything crazy here. Okay. Go ahead and grab it. There we go. Oh, Aiden? fuck. Uh, you doing that, Aiden? It's creepier when you play as her as a kid because she's vulnerable, you know? She doesn't really know. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on. Oh, what are these here? Perfect. All right, let's, let's just make sure there's nothing extra here in this room. Oh, won't you look at this? Interesting. Ah, you found it. Now we can get down to the serious business of bedtime stories. Oh, what the fuck, Jody. dude? Jody, you okay? You look pale. She looks dead tired is how she looks. Come on, Nathan, let's get her off to bed. Yes. Yes, hold on. Nathan, it's for you. Nathan Dawkins. his daughter Nathan. And his daughter died Nathan what's up my wife oh. Lord, they were coming back from my mother's truck drunk driver wrong side of the road They're 
dead. Um, Jody, let's get you off to bed. And just stay right here. I'll be right back. Come on, Jody. Oh, man. That's gotta be the like the worst, worst, worst pain in the world. I think I, I'd rather get all my limbs chopped off at once with a butter knife than to go through some shit like that. That is fucking horrible. Dude, that's so horrible. Oh my God. According to our intel, the Republic of Kazakhstan has discovered the existence of the Infoworld. Found a rift, conducting experiments from a secret base located in the province of Hailaojiang. We don't know what stage they are in their experiments, but we've detected important fluctuations within the Infoworld. That means they've found a way to interact with the other side. Now your mission is to destroy this condenser and any other advanced technology you find. Even if we manage to destroy the condenser, the rift will still be there. Now, building a condenser is a costly and time-consuming business. But this operation will gain time to better understand the infant world and make sure that no one will try to use it against us. I assume the site will be heavily guarded? Well, you should expect considerable military resistance. Team will. Team? Show them in, Marla. Hey, baby. Good to see you, girl. The oh, fuck? This is moron doing back here. Clayton's team goes with you, a small, agile commando unit able to avoid detection. The mission begins in two days. Good luck. Be careful, Jody. No one knows what you're going to find on the other side. Don't worry. I don't think I'm ready to join the infra world yet. Good. Because I don't want to lose you. Dude, I hate this Ryan dude or whatever the hell his name was. God, I fucking hated this man. It's good to see you. For the mission's sake, I'll try and forget what a fucking bastard you are. Jody, I... Is... You know what? Don't even try. That's right, bitch. I am falling for that pretty face no more. Crazy. Great. He thought he was going to get me with those sky blues he's got going on. I don't think so, bucko. Or is it, is it sky blues? Just make sure Rebecca's not behind me. She's going to think funny business is going on here. Baby blues, not sky blues. Baby blues. I grew tired of all this. If you refuse to cooperate, I will have no choice but to kill you. What the fuck? Of course, I will kill you regardless. But it could have been fast and painless. Instead, it will be a very, very slow and agonizing death. So, I ask you one last time. Who do you work for? Uh, He's nuts. Where are you? What is happening? Is that us right there? Is that us? It's completely deserted. You sure it's here? We're right on top of the coordinates. Storm's getting worse. What do we do now? 
Hey, Jody, ask Aiden to find a shelter somewhere. You hear that, Aiden? Okay. How about in here? Okay. How about... I would like to say inside this little house, but... Well, not that one. Um, this one either. Oh, there... Well, there... There we go. There's a house over there. Got it. Let's go. That's, that's actually what I was looking for, but I, could, I couldn't... This is not gonna end well. Oh shit. Shit! It's fucking freezing! What are we doing here? It's just a goddamn fishing village! Our informer duped us. That's what happened. We better get moving before I have to dig our frozen dead asses out of here. Three days, walking on ice, eating snow, for <laughs> nothing. <laughs> Fuck! I find the asshole that sent us here. Hey! I'm sick and tired of hearing you complain. That's all you have to say, then shut the fuck up! You guys, I'm freezing. You think maybe we could build a fire first and argue later? He's right. We'll set up camp here till the storm blows over. I'll contact HQ and get instructions. Alright, how the hell are we gonna build a fire? I've never built a fire. Not from scratch, that is. Unless anybody here's got some bright idea, and we're fucked. Everything's wet. Okay. What are we doing? Damn, all this stuff is soaking. <sighs> we better find something. What about in here? Hot coffee, maybe? Okay. Or hot water. Who knows? Maybe it's freezing water. I don't know. I'm gonna go out. I'm desperate for a pee. Are you crazy? So there's nothing here. There we go. You're a fucking genius. <laughs> Give me stop, Vince. Did you see that, Jody? Yeah. yeah great work, guys. <laughs> Bro, I feel I I feel like the game will be doing a, a disservice if we don't like know about our, our homeless family. Remember, we had a family we were homeless. I feel like we should definitely be able to know more about those people. I know they already have their life and. Don't go too far, okay? It's minus 40. I don't plan on doing any sightseeing. All right, there. All right, we're gonna go take a leak. In negative 40 degrees. This is a great idea. <laughs> Actually, it's a terrible idea. But I gotta pee, right? And right here, are you crazy? Fuck. Cody, this does not look like a good place to pee.
I don't think they saw us, right? Alright, we gotta go ahead and tell the guys. They probably they should have seen us. Oh. They're here. I saw them. Where? On the main road. A convoy of armored cars. They drove right by me. They see you? No. No, I don't think so. Let's roll. Let's follow them. Oh, sure, dude. Sure. This is very interesting. Oh, now we're skiing. <laughs> Bingo. Wow, I we didn't were literally see inside. We were literally right around the corner. Alright, here we go. Let's use Iden. This is probably where we get trapped. They probably kill the other two guys and then leave me and Ryan alive. I think that was his name, Ryan. I'm pretty bad with names, but hey. It's all good, baby baby. So what the fuck is this guy doing? Yep. Soldiers. They're loading crates into, into submarines. Submarines? That means the rift is. I mean, they must have a, a base down there and they're using the subs to shuttle supplies. Wow. How many soldiers? I can see three. Tell Aiden to take them out. Aiden? Get rid of them. Holy smokes. Wait, get rid of these? This idiot. Not. This guy. Gotta get rid of this guy first. Wait. Get rid of the soldiers first. Fucking hell, are you kidding me, dude? I'm supposed to choke him out. I don't know if this guy's gonna be able to spot me. The cameras and stuff. Yeah, these are the same uh, same vehicles they came in. I don't think this is gonna be possible. I mean, let's be honest here. Okay, so we're gonna go around. Can we please walk a little bit faster, you know? Not 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 a whole lot, just a little bit faster. That's probably one of the things about this game that's it's really not a big deal. You can't really walk faster. It's not just like sprint or anything, you just can't walk faster. Sometimes it's just a little you know. Where are the other soldiers? Yo, look at this guy's face, bro. <laughs> okay, so I guess the other the other couple of guys are probably inside the submarine underwater or something. Because there was more than just two of them. There's actually three out there and then one here in the security room. Right, so we're going to go ahead and open up the fence or the door. Not the fence, the door. The camera! 
there's cameras. <laughs> Fuck, Nick. Sorry. Oh, you could give me some warning. So, what do we do now? Just give me a second, okay? Oh shit, can I not take out the camera? Okay, maybe the cameras are not a big, big importance here. Hold on. Nothing here in the security room. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. I guess those cameras are for for whoever's in this room. And considering there's nobody here, it doesn't really make a big difference. All right. What, what exactly are you doing? I'm finding a solution to the problem. Nice idea, but it won't fool them very long. Yeah, well, maybe not. But that fucking rift is not gonna shut down by itself, is it? Okay. That might work from a distance. Then what? We take the sub down to the base. And then we take it from there. I'll go with her. What about us? It's a two-seater. You stay here, you find us a way out. By the time we get back, there's a good chance we're gonna have to move fast. What? Wait, that's in order, Nick. Give me the explosives. Holy smokes, bro. You do realize we might not make it back alive, right? Yeah, I've known that from the start. Bro, this is crazy as hell. This game just gets crazier and crazier. Keep diving. The base shouldn't be far. Oh shit, we're driving a submarine. <laughs> down here. We're probably gonna end up getting captured. We don't look anything like these people and we're in their uniform and we're literally going into their base Which is a uh, set up for disaster for failure there. Which is still interested in, 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 in what's gonna uh, I hope that wasn't a question I don't know I didn't probably speak the language I've got no idea. I am impressed. <laughs> You men would have heard that for so long. Perhaps 
you will be more sensitive to your comrades' pain. My questions are simple. I want to know your name, who you work for, and how you learn of the existence of this base. Of course, you also have to tell me what happened when you crossed the containment field. Just say nothing, you hear me? My name is Holmes. Jody, no. I, I Jody pressed. Holmes. I pressed A. Agent 894732. I work with the CIA. I pressed A accidentally, dude. I swear. So the CIA is aware of our little experiments. And what about the entity that was trapped in our containment field? He's tied to me. I was born with him. Fascinating. The Americans have also discovered the existence of this phenomenon. I must inform my superiors. I will return soon to continue our conversation. I mean, we saved his life at least. It was an accident. I, I probably wasn't going to press it. Sorry, you're right. Now what? We find the condenser, destroy it, and get out. And any idea how you plan to do that? No. <laughs> but I'll figure something out. What's that? It's a Woman, you didn't shoot you. Look out the shoot dead. Dude, this is so risky. This is terrible. What's the guy? the condenser before they realize something's up. Sir, should I say soldier? Up and down. Obviously, it's here. Big red door. Never say no to a big red door. But I had to kind of check everything in case. I respect. The door over there. That must be the way. Echoes coming from the rift. This is too easy. I don't like it. <gasps> Jody! Jody, what's happening? 
Aiden is trapped. Get off. One button. Holy. I am a Ligai. Woman, you are one Damon. Holy crap. Dude, and I was even gonna go here first. Wow, I was gonna go to this room first, too. What is going on? Hold on. Dude, I was actually going to go to that door before, man. Fucking crap. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh. Aiden. Oh. Yes. We're supposed to go here all this time. Oh, oh shit. Probably shouldn't have done that. Wait for me. If I'm not back in 15 minutes, just go without me. You're crazy? Look, Jordan, we've done it. The base is destroyed. Let's get out of here while we still can. The rift is wide open. Entities are just gonna come pouring out if we don't close it. It's too late, Jordan. We gotta go now. It's not right. You know that. Come on, 
explosives. I need the explosives in the interrogation room. Okay, interrogation room is here. No. Was this the interrogation room? Yes. <laughs> Look at this guy. You're dead. Let me just check again with Jody, maybe. Oh, if I go with Jody personally, I could get them. Okay. Maybe that's what it is. here oh, but in this room those entities are probably gonna take over the bodies kind of like what happened in the hospital that one time Fuck. oh this is freaky Jody, Jody, don't die. Jody, don't die. Jody, don't die on me. Oh, there's something down here. Oh, that's just a crate. There we go. Can't go there. <laughs> Let's go back. Anything in here again? Nope. Let's go the other way. Let's head over to where that suit was. Which I think I might be able to put that suit on. A bunch of entities there as well. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I gotta go this way. Bro, they're gonna take over those bodies. Just in case. Keep going down the hallway. Hold on. One more check. One one more check. Yes. Oh. Interesting. Oh, shit. What is this, an underwater suit? Oh, because we're going to the portal. Shit, I'm really scared, I didn't. Stay close, okay? Water to close the portal. This this right now feels like a dead space game, I swear. It's pitch black. There's gotta be a light on this thing. There we go. Keep calm, Biden. There's so many entities. I'm starting to wonder why they haven't tried to attack me yet. Considering they were attacking everyone in the fucking submarine or base, whatever that was. 
Um, unless they can see that I'm linked to, to some sort of entity as well. But I still don't trust them. Oh. What the fuck is that? There it is. Oh my god. There it is. Keep a low profile. Oh my god. one already no we have it so maybe there is four or three minutes okay never mind it's three oh no oh no oh no fuck Fucking kidding me? base is going to blow up. With that explosion, it's going to blow up the entire base. You're going to die here with me. <laughs> Your greatest discovery the world has ever known. Destroyed because of you, stupid American bitch. That's right, bitch. <laughs> Oh, well, yeah, I've lived. Oh, God, I've been waiting for this moment, you son of a gun. Oh, fuck, not the chain. Make you pay for what you've done, bro. Bro, we gotta get out of here, bro. I don't know if you know this, but we're gonna die. Okay. That laugh lets me know that you're just a psycho. You probably just don't give a fuck. Oh, oh no, now you don't lost it. Jody, please, I need I need some offense here. We can't be nothing but defense. I know the best defense is great offense, but we need some fucking offense. See you. I'm 
the other side. <laughs> business back in business the problems in this game are really confusing now maybe it could just be the nerves so i'm gonna shut up and i'm gonna focus up here i cannot multitask Tell me this guy left us. Please don't tell me he left us. Oh. <sighs> Fuck. You didn't think I'd let you down, huh? We're gonna drown. Oh no, we're not. We're not far from the surface. Maybe we can make it to the top alive. Yeah. Sounds like a fucking good plan. Oh, no it doesn't. Fuck it, we're doing it. Fuck it, YOLO. We're, we're gonna YOLO this. Ryan, you understand? We're gonna YOLO this. You better swim. Boy, you better swim. <laughs> Fuck. Bro, that water's gotta be freezing. I do not believe that. Hypothermia instantly dead. Maybe, maybe this suit, the one Jody's got, is like special, but 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 my boy Ryan here. <laughs> no, he is dead. There's no way he comes out alive. There is no way that man peeks his eye. You know what? I'm just gonna shut up. I don't believe it. This dude is on a literal tank top and he's in freezing water. <laughs> he would be dead. I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe the guy's some sort of special human being or something, right? Fuck. Fuck, I hate the cold. You still angry with me? Fuck you. Nah, I can't say he no. saved me. I'm too cold to be angry. <laughs> no. nah, he came back for us, or he waited for us. Although I we still never had time to tell you this, but um, I love you, Jody. Bro, what? I'll be sympathetic. In your circumstances, it'd be very. I wanted you to know, just in case we die here. Right? Ida can protect us, right? So how about you? Huh? Do you love me too? Dude, not really, but... 
Ah, fuck it. I love you, bro. Yeah. I love you, babe. Can I get a kiss? I mean, I'm dying to kiss. <laughs> Listen, man. I'm sorry. I, I got to do it to myself. I cannot go out on a bad note. We got to go out with love, passion, and compassion. Oh, fuck. <sighs> this is the Titanic all over again. Guys, I'm sorry. I kissed him again. I kissed him again. Okay? I'm sorry. <laughs> It never fails. I couldn't help it. I'm a sucker for love and romance. And uh, that's just uh, that's just what happened. That's what what well, that's what's happening here. See you on the other side. Oh my god, something's so dramatic. We didn't I don't tell me we die here. Nah. Nah, they don't die. Nah, they don't die. Nah, they don't die. There! It's them! Please, don't tell me they're dead. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fifty-six percent talk during the interrogation. I'm sorry, that was uh, an accident on my behalf. Ninety percent infiltrated the base possession. Fifty-eight percent forgave Ryan. I only forgave him because he stayed. He waited for us. Sixty-four percent infiltrated the base. Fifty-four percent emerged, uh, managed <laughs> to escape the base, and sixty-nine percent told Ryan you loved him. Man, sixty-nine percent. What are the odds of that number? Yeah. Anyways, I guess I, I, I can have some faith for humanity after seeing that number and, you know, everything that's happened. And, you know, that's kind of like the, the iconic s sexy number, if you will, 69, you know. Uh, Yeah, that was insane. I think we have one more. I think we have a little bit more to go. I'm not too sure. I know we had about two hours left, but I have been recording for about an hour and 40 minutes. So I, I don't know. I think we're going to end it here and then whatever happens next will happen. I will try and get it up ASAP. This is incredible. I don't know what the future holds for Jody and company, but I cannot wait to find out. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, as always, drop it a like. I'll catch you later.